Hey guys, how you doing today? As a couple of you guys already know, especially my buddy Gondalee69, or Gondale69, or one and only Gondale G, something like that. I can't remember what, how many names he's got, but it's basically it's Gondalee69 doing this video for him. Um, he's the one that actually inspired me to get into Airsoft. He's got some badass Airsoft got stuff, guys. So, we've got a decent selection of stuff. Um, we're going to review one item at a time. Starting with the one I got in the mail today. This here is um, the M24. It's got a metal barrel inside. I know it's hard to see without the light, but... It's got a metal barrel. The rest of the body is pretty much plastic. Um... It's got your fire and safety, fire, safety. My one favorite thing about this guy is besides the accuracy is the fact that the magazine's actually like legit. Um, it's a full size magazine, completely metal. It's very, very nice quality guys. Especially with this gun being an only $17 gun, it's got a feet per second rate of 290 feet per second with 0.2 BBs, 6 millimeter plastic. Um, just picked up a bag of these guys. These are fucking sweet. These are real precision. They're polished. Look at them guys. Those are beautiful. 3,500 of them. Yeah. But yeah, guys, it's this gun's pretty sweet. Cock it back for you. Real easy to cock. I'm running out of ways to show her that I like her. I assume you tried throwing you to Hammer doesn't pull back. I can't ask her to the which I, I know she likes me. Thought it would be kind of cool if it did. I got a um, Crossman Stinger. And that one actually pulls, the hammer pulls back with it. Um, this is one of the nicer guns that I have, actually. I don't have anything super, super nice. Like, the highest feet per second rate I have in, it, in my gun is probably 320, and that's going to be another pistol, the Stinger. And then, um, or not 320, I'm sorry. I do have a JLS M-8 coming, and that's supposed to be here this week. That has a fire rate of 390 feet per second. It's a spring-action rifle. But yeah, guys, this this is decent though. This is a decent sidearm to have. It's got a decent sight. Not bad. It hurts. You get shot with it. I I play around pretty much shooting that little gel target you got over there. See, that thing. You shoot it. The airsoft pellet sticks to it, and then it goes down, collects in the little tray, so you don't lose your BBs. Also, got a whole bunch of these. Zombie targets because I got paintballs, six millimeter paintballs that I use for my rifle. I don't use it in these guns because I don't want to fuck them up. Because you got to have at least 240 FPS in order for the paintballs to work good. So that's why I pretty much use them with the. Uh, I pretty much use them with this. We'll get into that when we get to that. Uh, this gun actually did come with one accessory. Came with a silencer. And it's a screw-on silencer. Plastic thread, though. you got to be really careful, so I'm going to pretty much keep it off. It doesn't really silence it at all. It just makes it look kind of cooler. Makes the barrel longer. But I'm not going to really use it, but it still looks pretty cool. So, yeah, guys. M36 is a great, or excuse me, M24 is a great buy. I got this one off eBay. Like I said, the magazine's sweet. And we will be back with more, guys. You have a wonderful day. Peace.